What's up YouTube? It's Michael with M Cold Outdoors. And on this video, I was fishing with a friend of mine, Patrick. We were fishing out of Pax Landing on Lake Marion, and it was a tournament held on the 4th of July. It wasn't an all-day tournament. It was from safe flight until 10 a.m. And we started out fishing the frog, buzz bait, didn't get a bite. So we ended up both putting on a Texas rig and fishing cypress trees, groups of cypress it. trees and single cypress trees. Hold on, Sam, we're about to net a fish. That's a decent little fish, too. This is right where we were supposed to be at. This was our first fish of the morning, and we had roughly around three hours of fishing time to give us enough time to make it back to the landing in time for weigh-in without penalty. So we found these group of trees, and I think we caught this fish right at around 9.15. This fish hit it right when I was reeling it up. I was about to reel it back to the boat and I felt him hit it. So I stopped and then he grabbed it and I set the hook. But usually I throw a jig when somebody, when the person in the front of the boat is throwing a worm. But we didn't have, this was our second fish. So, and we only had about 30 minutes to fish. So I just tied on the Texas rig also. And we both threw the same worm on a Texas rig and it ended up working for us. I wish we'd have found this group of trees a little bit earlier. We were bouncing around from groups of cypress trees all morning, just trying to find a fish, get a bite. And then once we got that bite, we slowed down and really fished it slow. Because usually if you get one bite, those trees are holding a lot more fish for some reason. If it's moving water or the water clarity, which this was muddy water, we had fished clear water earlier that morning and didn't get a bite and i always like a little stain on the water i don't mind fishing in the muddy water but we ended up catching the last three fish with about 10 minutes to go he should be hooked good he hit it like a brim like rattling he might have swallowed because i let him run with it chunking that's some healthy little fish though Patrick ended up catching two separate fish off this one tree. When he catches this fish, it was around, I think it was around three pounds. It was a decent fish. And then we went down the edge of the tree line and came back to this tree. And he ended up catching the last fish we needed on the very last cast on this same tree that he caught this fish on. This was our fifth fish to make a five fish limit for the tournament. We ended up having 12 pounds, four ounces. I think we ended up finishing like around seventh out of 20 boats. And some other people had a good mornings. They had anywhere between 15 pounds and uh, 17 pounds wanted overall. But it was a pretty good day. If we could have found these trees a little bit earlier, we might have done a little bit better or we might not have, who knows. But if you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching.